you can go to workplaces all over the world to see people doing their jobs. Here at Irving Shipbuilding, you'll see something else. With every weld, every inspection, our people are not just working, they're keeping a promise. To the crews who operate our vessels and to the country those crews protect. The ships that leave this yard will be ready for their mission, here at home or across the globe. The ships that leave this yard are Canadian made and world class. And the people who make them are proud to keep that promise and equally proud of the place where that promise is kept. Halifax Shipyard, where history meets innovation. That proud history is symbolized by our graving dock. For over 130 years, this dock has serviced any Canadian warship in need of repair or retrofit. Ships that have served in two world wars, the protection of Canada's sovereignty, and commitments around the world. This graving dock is a testament to Nova Scotia's rich shipbuilding heritage, just as the building to the north is a beacon of its exciting present. This is the Halifax Shipyard Assembly Hall, four football fields long, with enough ceiling clearance to house a 12-story building. This is one of the largest indoor modern shipbuilding facilities in North America, where our dedicated employees construct Canada's future fleet using industry-leading technologies and methods and always with an eye for detail. A single ship can require as much as 2,800 tons of structural steel, or the equivalent of about 2,000 cars, all of which enters from the south end of the assembly hall. Starting on the panel line where sub-assembly begins, computer-guided precision welding establishes the foundation of each bulkhead, deck, and outer structure of the ship from thousands of tons of structural steel. This steel is then assembled into units, adding cabling, piping, instrumentation, and other elements of the design. As those initial assemblies are completed, they move to our paint booths where as much as 9,000 gallons of paint can be applied to the parts of one ship. Units are then constructed into blocks and find their way here, the module hall, where those blocks become mega blocks. And more than 300 kilometers of cable is connected and more than 18,000 pieces of pipe are installed and tested. If our facilities weren't enough to convey the scale of the endeavor to which our people are committed, it's here with the mega blocks where it all becomes clear, where quality and expertise come together. Upon completion, these mega blocks are moved from the module hall to the land level, the final stage of construction in preparation for launch. Our ships are then lowered into Halifax Harbor in preparation for sea trials, the stage before delivery to the Royal Canadian Navy. Amazing things happen every day at the shipyard, but this is not the only amazing place at Irving Shipbuilding. Just as our graving dock is a proud symbol of our past, and our assembly hall a symbol of our present, our Blue Nose facility stands as a beacon of Irving's bold future. Here, we are designing some of the most modern surface combatant ships in the world delivering multi-purpose vessels with a full range of capabilities to meet the Royal Canadian Navy's evolving needs, from protecting our shores to humanitarian relief. It's here that we're creating Canada's future fleet, 15 ships, with construction set to commence in 2024 and final deliveries in 2040. For any shipbuilding professional, these spaces may seem familiar, but for the people of Irving Shipbuilding, these spaces are a source of pride. Because it's here that our people are unified in an effort that is truly bigger than themselves. Where they strive for excellence, to always improve, to discover a sense of purpose in what they do, and most importantly, keep our promise to the crews and country who depend on us. Share in that sense of purpose and join us.